Yes, I can recall ice jams and, and uh, in fact my mother took us up when the when the bridge went down way back in the, that must have been in the late 30s I think it went down the one bridge was taken out by the ice you know I wasn't very old so it didn't really make a big hoop de doo to me but they, everybody else enjoyed seeing it that, that you know what can happen with the power of, of nature I can remember my mother having me calling me at university to come home because the ice had formed a bridge here at Niagara on the lake and backed up down, up the entire river and it was completely choked with ice right from the right from the mouth of the river right back to Niagara Falls and that would be about 1954 so it was it was worth the drive coming home just just to see that again it had happened once before that I don't recall what year it was before I was quite small before but that one I remember coming down it's just hard to believe that the wind off the lake prevented the ice from getting out and it formed a barrier and it backed it right up all the way so that anybody that had a, a, a shed of any sort down near the, the bottom of the, the banks of the river they were just completely wiped right out.